decorations, mom and dad. <laughs> What's up everybody and welcome back to our channel. It is officially Kai's birthday week. So this video is gonna be all about getting ready for Kai's birthday. His actual birthday is on Wednesday, today's Monday and his party is Saturday. So we have a lot to do. But right now we are outside of a haircut place that like specializes for kids to get their hair cut and Kai's gonna get his very first haircut. I did try to cut his hair before and it was really bad. So really we were like, we need to get this cleaned up before his birthday. There's gonna be a lot of people there and we want, you know, our baby to have a decent haircut. So <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna go in and see how he does. I hope it goes well, but also this is a little monumentous. People don't prepare you for all of the firsts, like how it feels, it's awesome. Right, Kai? He's not feeling really too good today, but I think getting out and about has been really good for him. So we'll see, bye. Last checked in, we had just gotten Kai's haircut. That was on Monday, which was President's Day. So daycare was closed and I was off work. But we've had quite the turn of events since I last checked in with you guys. On Tuesday, Kai went to daycare regularly. He was a little bit congested, um, but he had no fever. And obviously the daycare has a fever policy. So they check the temperature every morning. They don't let any kids be at daycare if they have a fever. Um, but when I picked him up, they were saying he has a pretty high fever and Kai has not really had a lot of fevers, honestly. I, I was luckily able to get an appointment with the pediatrician right then. So we went straight from daycare to the pediatrician and he turns out he had an ear infection, which is also a first for Kai because he's never had an ear infection. I know that's a huge blessing because a lot of kids get ear infections like very frequently. So we survived a whole year with no ear infection and this is his first one. The doctor prescribed us some antibiotics, which we were also able to pick up that night. Like everything was a little chaotic, but we were able to get it all taken care of in that evening. And then um, Kai's obviously staying home today and I'm off work to take care of him. Definitely not the birthday that I would wish for him. The doctor said it's only gonna take a day or two for the medicine just to really start kicking in. So um, he should be up and running again soon. Um, but yeah, tonight we're just gonna do a little mini celebration, just the three of us. We got a little cake and a small gift and we're just gonna sing him happy birthday and have that family moment. But, but Saturday is like his big party where we've invited tons of people, like it's, at least 70 people um, because we just have really big families and lots of friends with kids and that is gonna be so much fun. There's also a few things that I still need to do this week to prep for that party. I need to put together some goodie bags and I need to fill up the pinata. Like it really hit me last night, like thinking, oh my gosh, we were like on the way to the hospital this time last year. I was so pregnant. <laughs> And I had no idea what to expect. Like, I did not know that the love that I would feel would be this much. Like, I just didn't know. 
I didn't know what it would get what it was gonna be like obviously I have nephews like I knew some things about babies but yeah like being a mom is the best thing in the world it's the best thing that's ever happened to me and Kai is incredible just being a mom is so awesome so I can't believe he's one it's so crazy I love him so much oh okay Kai you ready we're gonna sing to you Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kai. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> What'd you think about That's it? That's like the first thing he's eaten all day because he's been sick. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm gonna put together these goodie bags for Kai's party. Looks like Halloween over here. But I got a bunch of these from Amazon. These, there's, this is a hundred pack. I'm probably gonna make 80 goodie bags. And Katrina's business, K Dot Studios, made these little tags for us. You can see them here. So I'm gonna try to put a variety of this candy in each of these bags and hope it's enough. All right, I finished all 80 goodie bags. My little helper woke up. Kai approves of the goodie bags. I think they really turned out so cute. Huge thank you to K-Dot Studios. Love the disco ball. It's the little things. Right, Kai? Uh-oh. Yeah. I found some leftover candy. I don't think you, you can eat those, Kai. I'm sorry. Guys, Kai, when he's not feeling well, he just wants to be cozy. <laughs> it is now Friday, and Kai has been home since Wednesday, so he was um really not feeling good, still not feeling good. He has no fever now, which is good. Are you saying hi? <laughs> uh, but he's still coughing a lot and taking a lot of medicine. So we had to go to the doctor again yesterday because he woke up with a fever after like two days of still having a fever. So we were just concerned. But anyways, he's feeling better. I think he's going to be good by his birthday. Yeah, what is it? Also, Kai's birthday is disco themed. Woo! You like your disco ball pinata? Okay guys, it's party day. We are here at our venue. We have a nice little party room. It's all set up. Kai is actually with my mom right now um, because he is still not feeling fantastic. Just, we wanted him to have a nap at home and just feel, you know, cozy until like the last second before everybody wants to hold him and say hi and all of that. It's gonna be a lot of people here. So he's gonna be coming shortly and I'll show you guys the venue.
guys, it is the next morning. We've got Kai ready to open all his presents. It literally feels like Christmas. Like he's already ready. Some of them weren't wrapped. He is excited, right Kai? Are you excited to open your presents? <laughs> He's so excited. It was our first time planning a party for a one-year-old, obviously. I would say, oh no, he's got the salt. <laughs> uh, sorry, before Kai got the salt. Um, biggest party we ever planned was our wedding, which we had like a year and a half to, to do. And um, that was epic and so us and perfect. But I would say this is probably like the second biggest party that we ever planned. We had a lot of people come. And yeah, we had a few hiccups, like we ran out of food. That was not cool. But then we had to order some more pizzas and I think it was okay. But yeah, some lessons learned that we'll be able to avoid next year. Perks of having a huge family is that birthdays are like Christmas. I mean, he's getting so many presents. This is gonna be unreal. We are so <laughs> blessed to have so many people love on Kai. That's the biggest thing. How many people showed up for Kai. And like, that is the new way to show love to me is like loving on my child, showing up for my kid. And so, yeah, I was just overwhelmed with how many people came and how much love everyone had for him. He is so lucky. He's so blessed. And yeah, he's getting a little anxious to open his gifts. Kai, you wanna open your presents? You wanna open your presents? Yay! <laughs> vlog like opening a few gifts for Kai and it was really difficult because um you know we were trying to make sure Kai stayed in the frame and you know we were trying to get him to focus on one gift at a time and it was like kind of impossible so we just decided to stop vlogging but we opened all of the gifts there were so many it was amazing Kai loved everything and he is just such a blessed lucky boy to have so much given to him and so many people pouring into his life and loving on him and we just know that he is gonna grow up with the most supportive awesome family ever and we're just so thankful for all of that yeah he's got a lot to play with i'm gonna have to rotate these toys because he can't play with 50 toys at one time <laughs> But yeah, that is gonna wrap up this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.